environmental advocates in Miami-Dade as the county officially cut the ribbon on a new interactive art project designed to raise awareness about rising sea levels. And Local 10's Trent Kelly was right there for the big kickoff and explains the goal of this unique project. Two feet above sea level. That is how high the ground is here at Matheson Hammock Park. And the reason you see this large two etched in this sustainable concrete marker. This marker just placed here by officials today as part of a massive countywide effort to spark a conversation about our future. That pedestal serves as a base for knowledge, a place to educate you. A symbolic celebration in Southwest Miami-Dade as Matheson Hammock Park received its very first marker as part of a socially engaged art project that has an urgent call to action. Art is actually a way to people's hearts. So facts and figures may be overlooked or discarded, but when you connect emotionally with people, people can really hear the message. It's called the Underwater, an evolving installation on climate change first conceived by Miami-Dade's artist-in-residence. His inspiration coming after a visit to Antarctica more than 15 years ago. Scientists gave me a chunk of ice, put it in my hand, and said, this is going to melt and drown your city. What began as watercolor paintings made with Antarctic ice eventually led to the idea for these markers, made out of environmentally sustainable concrete from Supermix to be installed at county parks. The numbers displayed show the current elevation at that location, along with the QR code with instructions on how to create a yard sign for your own front lawn and links on how to reach your lawmakers and demand climate action. The hope is this community engagement will spark a discussion that helps everyday residents take ownership of a crisis that's already being felt. The thing you value the most, the thing that's worth the most in your life, which is your home, and the person you love the most, which is your child. And if you know that the thing that you value the most is vulnerable and your child isn't going to get it, then you're going to do something about it. Right now, this project is still in its early stages, so there are only a handful of these markers placed so far, but when it's all said and done, officials hope to have more than 280 of these across every single park in Miami-Dade. Reporting from Southwest Dade, I'm Trent Kelly, Local 10 News. And the important thing with these markers, because we've covered this on Don't Trash Our Treasure, is right. that it sparks conversation. Exactly. If you're not talking about it, you're not solving the problem. You know, if we do nothing to stop global emissions where they are right now, we're facing up to six to eight feet of sea level rise by the end of the century. That's just so crazy So we have to, to talk about, about it. it. We yeah. have to find solutions, and this is urgent. We have yeah. to really pay attention. So this is sparking that interest. Yes, Good. it is. Beautiful. All right.